In 2004, Diamondbacks reliever Tom Williamson was suspended for the season for testing positive for marijuana twice while he was a minor leaguer in the Brewers organization. At that point, Williamson decided to take an even longer break from baseball, five years total, to travel with his wife. Uh, we spent um, a month in Europe. Most of our travels were, were done here in our backyard in the United States. Uh, a lot of national parks, a lot of state parks, a lot of camping, a lot of hiking. Williamson returned to Tucson where he grew up. He then got a job at a tiki bar called The Hut, which sparked a nickname that he still has to this day. The bartender. Everyone called him that. I don't call him that. I call him, you know, T-Dubs. You meet a lot of different people. Um, you hear a lot of different stories. Um, some from people you know very well. Some from people you've never met before and you'll never see again. So that was kind of the fun part about uh, being behind the bar. Um, you're kind of a a therapist at times. Williamson returned to baseball with the independent Tucson Toros in 2009. Two years later, he made his major league debut with the Seattle Mariners, and he hasn't stopped dancing since. He uh, loves to keep it loose and he really loves to have fun. Um, you know, he's one of those guys who just enjoys, you know, life, I guess. You know, he always dancing, you know, just always having a good time, always a big smile on his face. But after two different stints with Seattle, broken up by a year in Texas, He's back in his home state. How about that? When I was a kid, I wanted to be a professional ball player. So being able to achieve that um, quite a few years later is like a dream come true. Um, and now wearing Arizona on my chest is like really the cherry on top of everything. Uh, doesn't get much better than that. Instead of serving up drinks in Tucson, he's now serving up strikeouts for the Diamondbacks. In Scottsdale, Troy Lynch, Cronkite News.